What's going on everyone? I want to go over my kind of strategy on what I plan on doing for gearing now that season one is here. I am sitting now at uh, 598. I will kind of walk you through at the end of this uh, kind of my step by step, but to give you a quick rundown, everything is open besides Mythic Pluses. And if you are uh, doing, if you have enough keys for Delves, then you should be good to go because it is dropping a 603 gear if you get to a tier eight. And so uh, if we go here to our World of Warcraft and look at the Delve system, which I think is, what is I? Oh, one of these, there we go, D Delves. You can see that I'm uh, in a little bit. I do have my, uh, my world quest complete for a tier eight uh, is the highest, I guess. So tier uh, 616. Uh, I did complete a mythic. I do need to complete a few more uh, to complete the day. And then I did complete uh, some bosses. So I did uh, the best route you want to go is delves if you have the keys because it is dropping just insane gear. And then you can swap in uh, a 603 gear for a tier piece and I did that with my uh, gloves here so that that gives me the tier uh, two piece. We now have our currencies upgraded so we do have a new maximum so you should be upgrading all of your low level gear uh, to the maximum so veteran I have everything besides my champion max and then obviously my adventure gear is just uh, low so I will just probably craft these um, maybe farm some heroics or something to get those um, pieces and then craft it or just keep running the delves which reset in four minutes. So I do have 14 coffer keys and you can run four delves, bountiful delves a day. I highly recommend turning on war mode and getting a few bloody tokens for a weapon that's veteran gear. This is uh, not too bad. Uh, it's veteran four out of eight and I'm halfway there in order to get that. So it's an easy upgrade if you uh, are farming war blood. And these are the bloody tokens I was talking about. You get honor, conquest, and bloody tokens from this chest in war mode. So something to think about. But for now, we are off to uh, get some delves. So um, we're gonna cap our four today get some upgraded gear and see where we're at. So we got one done. Let's see what uh, our bountiful is. We got uh, some uh, two-handed weapon. So uh, I love it. That's uh, actually the PVP weapon that we wanted. So we'll just grab all this, grab this gold and move on to the next uh, bountiful. Just make sure we get Brand all of his experience. He deserves it. He's carrying us. So I am now a 600. Uh, I want to go tell you kind of everything I did. I did do raid. Uh, so we got up to, if we go to raid info, we are five out of eight, I think. Yeah, five out of eight. And uh, probably will do some more later. No heroic raids, but I am sitting at mostly um, I level 600 with PvP. 603. I do have two pieces of tier. I do need to upgrade my uh, crafted gear, these two pieces. Um, I do have two rings that I need to upgrade also on the venture track. I did upgrade my, um, my wrists with blood gear. Uh, so from PVP, because it's perfect stats, why not? Um, and that's about it. So I do, I could use, I do have some conquest and some honor, which I might be able to use uh, here in a bit. And I can still form up some uh, heavengers and some carved to be able to uh, upgrade some of these pieces. Um, none of these pieces actually can be upgraded. Um, I do need to upgrade, well, these adventures this adventure ring could, but I do need uh, a, a ring from uh, a mythic zero or 
uh, my great vault or the bounties. So that's about it. I mean, all I've like literally done is use my keys and a few raids um, or one raid and it's got me the gear I needed. So it's a pretty, I mean, it's pretty much that easy. To... I am going to run one more um, heroic essentially um, because I can get upgrade my rings to the maximum of the adventure. Other than that, I think that is pretty much my only other adventure piece. Champion, 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 veteran, champion, and champion. All of this other stuff is veteran and is already upgraded to max. You can probably upgrade this to a higher uh, level. 603. Um, so we can do that. Um, but that, I mean, that's pretty much all. I mean, I could go run um, one more heroic and then upgrade my ring. And then if I get a, a different ring, uh, I can upgrade that. But that would put me on that next uh, course, which would be the champion gear. Um, but tomorrow I could go run. I think I have like, let's see, I have 10 more keys. So essentially I have two more days, maybe three to get um, a few pieces of two rings essentially to replace this. And then besides that, uh, and then a, a chest, helm and shoulders. No, just chest and helm because those are uh, on the veteran track. Everything else is on the champion track. And I, the only way I can upgrade that stuff is with um, carved harbingers, and those come from uh, Mythic Threes. So I probably won't get them until without with only Bountifuls, and with my um, doing key ch keystones above three. So not much I can do for now. But that's it guys, remember, remember to like and subscribe. So if I were to summarize what you should do is you should do all your world quests and all of the weekly events from the PVP, the PVE, spreading the light, uh, the machine, the arena, not the arena, the theater, all of those try and do. That will allow you to get some veteran gear, I believe is what it drops. Uh, from there, you want to go and run your delves up to eight and you use your keys on bountiful eights. Uh, once you are comfortable with a bountiful, then you can keep going higher. We went up to, I believe, let's see, if I go back, um, we went up to uh, 10. So we, uh, are, actually we went to 11. Uh, so we are on the last delve and um, then we are done, I believe. I think that is the last one, the High Explorer. So um, pretty, pretty, pretty much that's it. We'll probably run that today or tomorrow, uh, finish up with that. But other than that, I mean, there is, there's raiding after that. And then from there, uh, next week comes Mythic Keys and uh, Mythic Dungeon, or De Mythic Raids. So you have a lot to choose from to get over 600. So I hope that was helpful for you guys and I'll see you on the next one.